Now I want to show you a couple things here. So I have, um, I have the cat's eye beads to show you what that does. It slightly increases critical hit chance. And then the next one I have is this one. Um, you want to increase your mana because that's going to help you. You definitely want to use cloud step a lot so you can um, charge up your focus attack and do a heavy attack on uh, the, the sage's broken shell. And then I also have this modeling increases the speed of building up focus points. You definitely need that because you want to use a lot of heavy attacks to bring this guy's self down. And then I'm going to show you my actual. So I kept the staff, kept the staff that they give you at the end of the game. Okay. Definitely want to keep that. Um, cause that is like the most powerful one. And then you have the winds, uh, thing, the qua uh, quai, a key. Yeah. Keep the wind key. That's going to definitely help you. And while it's, um, taking its effect on the sage, you can beat him. You can hit him and, and cause significant damage on him. Um, and I have this guy, the headbutt guy. He does a lot of damage when he's fully upgraded and, and I have him fully upgraded. I have the, you know, the shoes that they give you at the end of the game. I got the, the arm, um, the, um, the braces. And then this right here, because you're going to be fighting in water, you're going to need this. This is, this is significant. So make sure you get this. This is going to help you out massively. So, um, you need this, uh, serpent skill battle robe. I think you get this after you beat the, um, What's that water guy's name? Oh, I forget his name. He's like the second or third boss in, in the beginning of the game. But you'll need this because this is going to um, increase your health by a small amount while you're in water. So you're going to need your health <laughs> as much as you possibly can. But I'm going to change mine now because obviously I don't need it. Stand down. Yep. Stand down, orangutan. Yeah! That is beautiful. Uh, yeah, skis. Get out of here, man. Your phase is done. Where's the next phase? I know it's coming. <laughs> so bring it on. Bring it on. You all right? You gonna live, bro? You gonna live? Oh. Okay. I'm probably gonna die first try, but I'll do my best. <laughs> I guess. Woo! Great Sage's broken shell. He's gonna be broken even more though. I'm gonna break him even more. It won't even matter. Let's get it cracking.
Got him. Second phase. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Oh. Block him. Oh. 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 Karate master. Oh, he's taking everything from me. Take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. Just, you'll live. You'll live. He won't. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's okay. It's alright, monkey. There we go. You can have all that. I don't need it. I don't need it. Bro, I, I don't need that. Damn, I look good. In gold. Even though that's not me, per se. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. What do we have here? He's a zombie, pretty much. He's a zombie monkey, guys. He's a shell of his former self. That's what he is.
Oh my goodness, I did it. I freaking did it. I beat him. <laughs> Yo. So you guys, I'm gonna show you what I did after. Let's show you how I beat this dude. Wow, I got I got really lucky. I finally did it. And I wanna beat the last, last boss in the game. There's a special secret boss with the secret sauce, homie. You must have heard tales about him. Some say he helped Tung Monk fetch the scriptures, was granted Buddhahood, and stayed on Mount Lingshan thereafter. Some say it was not him who was granted Buddhahood. The real him was already dead on the journey to the West. Some say that the journey never happened. He is nothing but a monkey who lives in some storyteller's tall tale. <laughs> but now... You will hear a tale which no one has ever known.